Okay, we have this uh, patient, young patient, who had uh, oral squamosal carcinoma of left, left side, left mandible, and also involvement of the outer skin. It was a very aggressive disease. It was a very aggressive disease, and we had done a full, complete uh, left side hemimandibulectomy, and we had done only soft tissue reconstruction. Okay, uh, soft tissue reconstruction was done with pectoralis major flap, which was taken from the left side of chest, and also delta pectoral flap from here. You can see the incision line. From here to cover the this outer skin. Okay, you can see the You can see the inside lining. This is the inside lining. This is the inside lining, which is pectoral major flap. Okay, and he has completed almost two years after the surgery, and other only only thing we notice after this operation reconstruction. The mandible slightly deviates. You can see mandible slightly deviates towards the affected side. And the occlusion is fine with guidance, but that is the that that is only on uh, disadvantage with the soft tissue reconstruction. Okay, but in some cases we need to do only soft tissue reconstruction depending upon the disease, depending upon the size of the defect and aggressiveness of the disease and everything. So he is doing fine now. He is under follow-up every three months.